This is a Rinco Brasilalia. That's a mouthful. So it's shortened to RBY. Dosa Lemon Carrots Cooler. Now, can you guess by the name one of the parents of this plant? If you guessed Brassavola nodosa, the species, you are correct. Dosa is from, in the name Dosa Lemon. Dosa comes from the parent Brassavola nodosa. Now, I'll put up a picture of what lemon tree looks like. It's a con color yellow. It's the only picture I've been able to find on the internet of what it looks like. And I'll also put up a picture of Brassavola nodosa. Now, Brassavola nodosa typically has much smaller flowers. And this flower here, this plant, is getting a lot of its genetics from lemon tree. The size of the flower from lemon tree and the height of the plant from lemon tree. Most of the time, Brassavola nodosas are much shorter, more, um, maybe about what, eight inches tall maybe uh, for those plants. This plant here, I measured this tall pseudobulb right here. So, oops. so I measured from where it comes out at the rhizome up to the tip of the leaf here, and I got 18 inches. I suspect this plant still has a little bit more to grow. It will probably get a little bit larger as it grows and matures a little bit more. Um, it, I mean, I'm not saying that it's not a mature plant. It obviously is a mature plant, but I think it could get a little tad larger, maybe up to 20 inches, maybe. Now, let's see. Look at the flower here. Look at that. Now, this flower is getting the big lip here from the Brassavola nodosa. Brassavola nodosa, as you saw in the picture, had the little green sepals and petals, but the lip was nice white, kind of a little heart-shaped lip, and it's much larger in proportion to the petals and the sepals. But this flower here got definitely a larger lip on it. Now, another interesting thing is this flower, when it opens, when the, they're very, very pale, pale yellow, and then they fade to cream. But Brassavola nodosa is an interesting parent in the, the fact that most of the time it will pass on freckles, spots, into its progeny. It did not do that here. Lemon tree overtook. Lemon tree is a con color yellow, and its genetics took over the flower here, and we have no spots on these flowers at all. The only thing that I've noticed of any color slightly was the last two flowers that opened up, and they have just a little tinge of pink inside, just a little bit here on the edging here. None of the other flowers have that. So I don't know if in, if in different conditions, more of the flowers might get that little picketty edging there. Um, I have seen a couple of these plants. This is one that I got from a place that I volunteer at. I've talked about that in many of my videos and they are doing a renovation of an antique greenhouse. It was built in 1913 and it's due for some renovating and re restoration is really a better word than renovations, but restoration. And this plant here takes after Brassavola nodosa in the fact that it's very, very prolific. It, it's almost like a weed. They're telling me you just really can't kill it. <laughs> um, but it had, they had so many divisions of this plant. So they kept a plant in their collection and then they got rid of a couple of them. I donated one to the other place that I volunteer at and then I got this plant here for myself. And like I said, it's got eight flowers on it in four inflorescence, four flower spikes is another way of saying that. And each of the spikes has two flowers on it. Now, I have seen this plant, the other one that I donated, it had four flowers on its spike. 
So it only had one spike on that particular division and it had a lot taller inflorescence and had four flowers on it. So I know this is capable of more flowers per inflorescence. So that's a little exciting. Now, another thing that um, Brassavola nodosa, that large lip that it has, it's white and the rest of the petals and sepals are green. At night, that attracts a moth to pollinate it. That's why the lip is white, so that at nighttime it will attract its pollinator. Okay, that also means it is night fragrant. Some orchids, they don't have fragrance at night. It really doesn't matter. Brassavola nodosa has a fragrance, but you smell it at night. This dosa lemon, you smell it all day, all day. Different times of the day, it will waffle in and out of stronger scent, but you can definitely smell it. A little citrusy, it's very faint right now, but in the mornings I've noticed, and in the evenings, it has a much stronger smell. So guys, I wanted to finish up the update of what's in bloom. I hope you enjoy this. Let's see here. It's so, it just like get my brain going. RBY stands for Rinko Brassolalia Dosa Lemon Carrots Cooler. Until next time, guys. Happy orchid growing. Bye.